This is where things get really exciting. Let's imagine for a moment all the things we'd like to be able to do with a digital impressioning system. Well now with BlueCam, because we can capture a full arch, these things are possible. We can create a physical model and we can collaborate with a laboratory via Ceret Connect, not only for single teeth, but for multiple restorations as well. Or if we'd like to continue to work chair side, we have the benefit of being able to view and assess, analyze and use the entire arch during the design process. Now we're going to take a full arch digital impression starting on the left side. The process begins with drying off the quadrant all the way past the midline, followed by placement of a dry angle in order to better isolate the area. Next we're going to place a light coat of Opti Spray and I'm going to start on the distal buckle at about a 45 degree angle and move toward the mesial as I spray all the way across the midline. Next I'll repeat that from the lingual, get a little bit more here across the midline and we'll go across the lingual. Now we're going to activate the camera in live capture mode and go all the way to the most distal tooth. And as I stabilize the camera, the first image will capture automatically and we'll see the model begin to grow on the screen. Then as I move forward, I'm going to overlap by about 50%, stopping each time and allowing the capturing system to capture an additional image. As I do so, we'll see the model grow on the screen. And we'll go all the way past the canine to the lateral and central incisors. And again, crossing the midline. Notice I'm also capturing a bit of the palatal area with these midline images. Now we're going to do the other half of the arch by drying it and repeating the powdering process as before. We've got a dry angle in place, we're going to start at about a 45 degree angle to the buckle, spraying a light coat of Opti Spray all the way across the midline again. This is followed by a light coat across the lingual. Just like that. Now we'll reactivate the camera in live capture mode and this time we're going to start from the mesial and go to the distal. So I'm actually going to start on the lateral to central incisor area of the opposite side of the arch or the side that I just captured. And then we'll work our way mesial to distal crossing across the midline and working into the arch or rather the quadrant that we're capturing in this imaging session. And again, because I'm in live capture mode, we can see that as I stabilize the camera, images are captured automatically and then added to the growing arch on the uh, screen on the left-hand side, or on the right-hand side, rather. And we're going to go all the way back to the second molar. And once complete, we'll have a full arch digital impression. So with the new digital impressioning system, we actually saw a very efficient way to create a full arch impression. This opens up all sorts of new possibilities with regard to not only chair side CAD CAM, but also collaborating with a laboratory and creation of a physical model from which a laboratory can create a variety of different types of restorations. The future is indeed very bright.